Hello guys, welcome back. This is your boy again. I'm Slink. I hope you guys are doing okay. Please try as much as possible to like this video, comment, share it on all social platforms, follow me on Instagram, Twitter, Facebook, Adam Slink Media. Make sure you subscribe and click that bell notification to get updates anytime and the day I upload. And meanwhile, good morning, good afternoon, good evening, wherever you are watching this video from. Ha! I have so many things to discuss. I'm gonna be discussing Zlatan and Digital Copy Fight. And that's exactly what is going on between them. But first, let me share you this video of two evangelists fighting over a space. Two evangelists, guys, fighting over a space in Lagos, Ikeja, Lagos. Fighting over a space, guys. Sorry to say this. Huh? Sorry to say this as a, as a Christian, for two Christians, it seems like you guys are divided. Very, very divided. Very, very. We are both serving God. Why must you fight over a space? Fighting over a space. And you say you are going out there to preach for people. Why you have so much hate in your mind? why you are fighting your neighbor you don't even love your neighbor as yourself you don't even love yourself to the extent that see you are not you don't even know what might go on but you are fighting over his space and you are preaching <laughs> so better still you just wanted to know that see all those evangelists going out there to preach uh, it's a really good work oh. evangelism is a really really good work we are doing the work of god if you do it wholeheartedly wholeheartedly I'm telling you, ah, uh, for what I have read about, for what I have uh, read, I'm telling you that when you do evangelism wholeheartedly, that heaven is sure for you. But all those people, evangelists, you see in in, in in this country, you see in the marketplace shouting, calling, most of them, eh, most majority of them, uh, forget oh, they don't practice what they preach. The Bible is easy to quote. It's easy to say, to read, because it doesn't it doesn't cost you while you are reading it and you don't practice it. It doesn't. You can read it. Even a uh, even a even a native daughter can pick a Bible and read. It doesn't cost you. It doesn't do anything to you. Even Quran self can pick it and read. But you reading it, do you really mean what you are reading? Huh? We are going to a preacher and fighting your fellow, your fellow, oh man, really crazy. And meanwhile, let's talk about uh, DJ Copy and uh, Zlatan. According to uh, one man who is really close to Davido, is one of Davido's crew, this is what he said. You know, uh, Zlatan and the Copy are having some serious issue. Uh, when the Zlatan when ask, was asked in an interview that if he has heard of DJ Copy and that the issue between him and, and DJ Copy, he said that he doesn't know DJ Copy, that if that is a musician, he doesn't know. And people were saying that he was rude, he was rude for saying all those things. Well, firstly, uh, let me, according to Israel DMW, he's part of the uh, Davidos crew, he said, kudos to someone like Zlatan who took a bold step by flushing out a food fake friend like Copy who was just using his head all in the name of my papa now or Ted Dollar. Zlatan did a hit collab with her ordinary one Kobo in Osi. She also took Zlatan to Abuja for a fun raising where she made billions of naira and did even remember Z for one couple till tomorrow. No accommodation, no feedings Latin had to even spend his own personal money at Transcorp Hilton to cater for everyone including me. This now 2021 I beg. Never just pretend to be happy when you are fully not. Israel uh, part of the uh, Davidos crew that what he said. Well, uh, now I see the reason why, if this is the reason, if this is the reason, because for me, I'm not so convinced or if that's not a particular reason. 
uh now see the but some people see the reason that yeah some people say that if actually this is what did the copy did that is enough for Zlatan to block her on Instagram and block her on Facebook and deny her well that what they said and then here's a video fast forward here's a video of Zlatan explaining to David o where he was during that time they said that they were in trust corp Hilton. Where you did? I did where they were telling that the chef I for them million, one billion. I did you know, she died no touch our hand, just the east money they yeah money. Five hundred million. Five hundred million. Five billion to this one. Go to gelato, go to gelato, go to gelato, gelato, gelato. You can hear he hear him. And then meanwhile, uh the DJ copy wasn't even moved by this. She simply said, Super story, free copy. And she said, I've learned to kill them with kindness and raise above, arise above the noise. Copy gold dogs. Then, uh, uh, Cynthia Morgan said, Lo, maybe Zlatan was asking copy out. Honestly, I've said that before. See, I've said it before. Did you copy recently? This is what she, she said. When she was asked about the people she collab with, she who actually out, outrightly said, every single artist featured on my original copy album wanted to work with me and did not collect, collect a single penny. Baby boy, try again. That was in 2020. She said all those artists that work with her on her album, including Zlatan, never collected any penny. So me, I'm still of the opinion that maybe Zlatan hacks that how to. Because I don't understand why someone will invite me all the way, a girl will invite me all the way from one city to the another to fundraising. A girl that I'm not attracted to, to fund, like it's not like Come on, man. I worked with her on Gelato and I didn't get any bar from her. And she's inviting me to fundraising in, uh, in Abuja. <laughs> and I still went there. Except there's something you want, Latan. Let us be honest. Zlatan, Zlatan was doing all those stuff. Maybe because he wants to look good for copy and they want to get to know copy and to get that juice. Now, Otedola beginner. That's what I think. And I still on the opinion that Zlatan may have had that heart. And she was dulling Zlatan. Zlatan would be like, man, this girl, they don't me since. And I'll be spending money. Spending money. Spending money. I didn't collect a dime from this girl. I went to trash her Hilton. I took care of myself and she invited me. So all those stuff, all those millions that Zlatan has spent. Really got him angry and be like, okay, F you. Immediately block her. All those kind of stuff. Because it's just what we can see, or that's what we can tell. But honestly, if you look it very closely, it seems like Latin hacks that out. Talking about money, here's a woman who recently returned 38 million naira mistakenly paid into her account by a debtor. A Chinese company was supposed to pay her 48,000 Naira. But the Chinese company saying that Lai Lao, they won't pay her 48,000 Naira. That they will pay her 38,000 Naira. The woman could say, okay, since you are saying that you won't pay me exactly what you owe me, 48,000 Naira, please then pay me the 38,000 Naira, let me rest. Out of hand, I don't know, I don't know how they did it. The Chinese company accidentally transferred 38 million into her account. They transferred 38 million naira into her account. Well, she, uh, of course, refunded it and uh, it was, according to herself, this is something, this is something to love. Ishmael did business with company in China. They were to return 41k to her for the product they did not have. They refused to. They, they said they would only return 38k. 
after much back and forth and then refused to return the full 41k she told them to return the 38k they were insisting on they agreed chinese company returned 38 million <laughs> obviously an error from them maybe they were hungry and basically added more zero than they should have they were scared and thought uh, Ishmael would not return the money. She did return the money but deduct the bank charges. And then the Chinese company returned the 441k they really should have returned for starters. Nigeria are great people. We, we are well done. Proud of you. Proud of this woman. She actually really returned the 38k. And in Chinese, how greedy they are. They just decided to, okay, since she returned the 38, uh, 38 million, let us better give her that 41k that she's asking for. Why didn't you make it 400 something k or 1 million? It's greedy. Well, Nigeria people are actually good people. Eh? We are not thieves. We are never, never thieves. And uh, for those of you in Lagos, know now that the federal government are contemplating to, to issue a fresh lock down in Lagos alone because of the increase <laughs> ever increasing uh, C19 cases so be ready be ready and uh, here is this particular guy who came out gay yesterday this guy Uche came out gay yesterday and now he made a video saying that he is proudly gay don't let anybody intimidate you Come out, show your identity. You are who you are, boy. You are who you are. Don't let anybody intimidate you. I be gay, I no be full and the heads man, and I'm proud. <laughs> well, uh, he's gay and he's proud. He just said that. And uh, here is one of the most funny tweets I've seen today. And this is coming from uh, an American citizen. He said, most amazing things I've learned today maca you know like make america great again is in nigeria pala a word that means easily fooled idiot of course maga we already know what maga actually stands for in nigeria maga in america may means make make america great again that that slag was was used has been used by donald trump and his followers make america great again but maga in nigeria means a fooled idiot man that my maga be that one. i don't catch that maga that what it actually means to us but they don't know but this america guy recently find out that yes maga doesn't really means make america great again that it means a fooled idiot and he said so hey they are all maga false nigeria knew what you were long before the rest of us did they are all maga i'm talking about maga the u.s recently donated 325 us dollar worth of equipment to nigeria police to combat bk boys to combat bk boys 325,000, not millions so 325,000 us dollar not millions so to combat uh, to the police to combat uh, BK boys and Nigerians were complaining that the money is too small. See in Nigeria, they will still end up they might still end up selling those equipment because I know maybe it might be drones or those kind of stuff, but they might still end up selling it though. And uh, one of Whiskey Baby Mama came out to announce that she has she was involved in an accident recently. You know. This accident, accident following whiskey baby mamas. I think it's something that he really need to visit one Babalawa or the other to tell him exactly what is wrong, because his first baby mama had an accident, and on the same day it was reported that his second baby mama also did, and now his second baby mama is also coming out again now to say this is the second accident that she's involving in. So what is wrong with accident with uh, with whiskey baby mamas? Please whiskey this is someone to clarify all those stuff for you i mean what thank you very much for watching i don't have so much to talk in this video and uh please try as much as possible to like this video comment share it on ocean the platform follow me instagram twitter facebook adams linking media and have a wonderful day 
and uh see you tomorrow or oh, on my other channel please uh like I've, oh i forgot my other channel is boomy currently and if you want to check just subscribe just simply check the link in the description below you see my other channel check it and click on it and please subscribe huh? assist your boy it's a boy adam's link bye